Mm -hmm. Because you don't know what you're going yeah. there to. Oh, okay, moving on. Daily Odule prays in tears for divine intervention to end online begging for veteran actors mm -hmm. and actresses. What are we doing about that? I think we said so in the course of our discussion. I said so that let's uh, get the right support. Let the industry get the practitioner get the right support so that at the end of the day, they don't end up begging. We need the right support. We need the corporate bodies to support the industry. We need government to give that enabling environment. If I want to shoot on Ali, why can't I shoot? If I get the necessary permit, why? And if I get the necessary permit, I'm shooting there, area boys come to destroy things. There's no form of protection from the government. Why can't I get the protection? Why can't I get it? So the enabling environment is very, very important. But well, these um, veteran actors and actresses that we've seen way back, that we love seeing on our screen, coming back to beg, what exactly? You see, in everything in life, you work. The time is coming, you can no longer work. So what if about you the ones that work money for? from what you worked in your early days, then what's the essence? Mm. So that's why, again, we need the Mopicon bill on stream. Okay. The government is like they don't have the willpower. Over, they've been dodging it. The Motion Picture Practitioner Council uh, um, uh, bill mm. that is still lying in the National Assembly it should be passed, so that all the some of the points you have raised today, the solution is embedded in that bill. Some well, people don't want you to talk about it for whatever reason. I don't know, but I will say it, and I will say it over and over again. I also happened to be a member of the review committee some few years ago mm. under the last administration. So we thought, yes, we've, we've gotten there. Unfortunately, see now nothing has been done. So the motion picture practi uh, practitioner council bill, Moticom bill, has to be passed into law. So it will regulate the industry to tell you a practitioner is, it will define for each of the practitioner the, the prerequisite mm. for you to be mm. and how everything. If they talk about conflict resolution and some of the things you are raising that the likes of Dilo Dulia are begging yeah. and praying. Sometimes we pray. The prayer will not do everything. Let's do the right things. If the industry operates the same way banking is operating, the same way the NSC bill is there, uh, Nigeria Society of Engineers, the same way with the uh, the lawyers own and others, and you have the practitioner uh, the industry own. And why won't they look at this industry? This industry outside government is the highest employer of labor. In one film, you can employ as much as 100 people per film. Mm. So, and you are saying there is youth unrest, there is this, and you are not supporting that. The government should really come out. But, and but, but talking about the government now, or you talking about they passing the law, a lot of times we see these celebrities with these politicians taking pictures, wine and dine. Is it that, I don't know, what exactly are they doing there? Well, I think uh, it's, uh, to a large extent, I would say it's still, it's still hunger. <laughs> yes, that's, what, that's the only way I can. Okay. It's hunger, yes. Mm. It's hunger. It's hunger. Otherwise, as a politician, as, uh, as, as, as an actor of repute, you know, you belong to, you're, you're actually to an extent, in public, you are political. In public, you are, you are political. You don't belong to any of these things. When mm. it comes to time, a time to vote, you know who you are going to vote for. Because everybody across party, you have your fans caught across party. Mm. It's only when there's hunger, maybe if I go, you will, you will take what uh, delete uh, Baba Gunde will say, Balajem. Mm. You get some Balajem from him, man. That's mm. how you see them. They are now shameless. They, care, they couldn't care less whether my fan is a member of party, party A, B, or, or C. Yes, they they don't just care. see them. They don't. That thing should be with you. When it's time for election to vote, you go and yes, you do your vote don't. and you get, um, you get out of the place. Mm. Uh, part of my language. So it's very, very important. So it's hunger. I or what you're about to call AB. AB. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't say that. He said it. You 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 said Okay, lastly, you're not your How not. come you speak so well? And then you, even your proverb, me that I'm your bag, you're going to be in this. It's interesting. Is it a passion? Well, uh, uh, how do I put it now? You know, there's been this hot debates on our various uh, industry social media about the history of Nollywood. 
I say, ah, it's for well, it's your bad that started this thing. Yes. Everybody will say, oh, Nollywood well, started with uh, living in bondage. Yes. That one will say this thing. And I've been like, we have a lot of the problem of um, uh, content distribution and monetization, which is at the sh we should be at the front burner. Nobody mm. is talking about that. You are the, so everything is reduced to politics. So, but then I was born in island maternity okay. in Lagos in Island. Lagos island. Yes. yes, sometimes in the sixties, I grew up in Ibutimeta. Okay, Ibutimeta. In uh, <laughs> where the first compound where I was born, where I grew up, uh, is uh, they call it Ujuno in front of where I think uh, uh, the Akpalara Ogundu crisis um, okay. you, won't, you may not know that okay. uh, no, I happened. lived in Ibute Meza so yeah so Takba by Jeba the house is number 8 Takba so that's how I was born you have a ballet for Akogun uh -uh. uh -uh. uh -uh. so we see some of all these things we are part of some of these things growing up mm. so I didn't see myself differently until these days in politics uh, you are not your banner can yeah. you continue? Why should you do this? And I laugh because those saying that they are not even Lagosians. Mm. That's what I've mm. realized. Thank you. The most important thing is we should embrace what we have. We should be one Nigerian. Yes, That's just the thing. See Nigeria. yourself first as a Nigerian yes. before any other thing. That's it. All this type of thing, it shows how shallow some people, uh, people are. Mm. In fact, that's what I used to define people. If I want to know how shallow is, a person is, when they begin to talk about that parochial sentiment mm. of tribalism and the rest you I just, just move away you move uh, yes, I said this the <laughs> okay so and let's move thank you very much for joining us on this segment uh, and i'm sure that you enjoyed my guest and if you want to be a filmmaker like you said you need to know what you want you need to know your talent your strength so that you can do well on that thank you very much for joining us and thank you for coming on the thank show 